there, brothers and sisters in Christ. Happy, thankful Thursday for everyone. There are a lot of things to be thankful for today. Are you happy and thankful today? Well, I am. First, I am happy to be alive. I'm happy that I'm still breathing and I'm thankful to God for the extra time that He has given me so that I could spend time with my family, my loved ones, and above all, spend time with Him in praying and reading His words. Yesterday, I was so privileged to read Psalms 37 and I realized in that chapter, it has a lot of verbs, imperative verbs. And these verbs are a commandment for us to do what we need to do. Our God is a God of action and therefore he too wants us to follow his commandments to be obedient to his laws for he is a god who does not lie and he keeps his promises so we too should also keep our promises to him and we should obey him psalms 37 says delight yourself in the lord and he will give you the desires of heart do we delight in praising God? The Bible tells us the angels are praising God in singing. As we praise God, He takes our anger and replaces it with compassion. He destroys bitterness and replaces it with mercy. When we praise God in the midst of difficulties, we find our eyes turn toward the Lord and we find healing in every aspects of our life may I pray with you our great God of any father we praise and honor you for you are indeed a mighty God we trust dear Lord that you have great plans for us and we delight in your presence dear Lord we ask that you please take away all our fears, all our anxieties, and help us to fully trust in you, fully trust that you will uphold us into your righteous right hand and deliver us in times of trouble. Thank you so much for all of these things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Why don't you write down five things? that you are thankful for each day and you will see that God constantly blesses you each day. God bless and may you all be safe.